I sure like to punish myself, I tell you what. And I don't mean the mess in here. I'm getting ready to handle that. <sighs> it's what's in the back of my truck, guys. Nice cobweb there. Oh, a huge weight machine. Two of us to load it and it wasn't fun. Now I gotta get it out by myself. That's gonna be interesting. Maybe I'll get hurt. Y'all like seeing stuff like that on here, but I'm gonna do my best not to. Don't really have a plan, but before I do that, I gotta get the old the table, those two chairs, move them into the shop. Go see where I got a spot for them. I'll show you the tables I'm speaking of. These, my plan is to put that machine right here, but I'm not sure if it's gonna clear the fan. Uh, actually, it'll probably fit right here. We'll figure it out, but I need to get this table cleared off and get this in there. Let's go see if we got enough room in there. Well, I think we might see some puppy dogs on the way. Uh, Millie, for some reason, she's scared of this camera. I could come out here with the phone. There they are. They were under there. Look at this stupid... <laughs> Look at this silly rooster. He's just sitting out here all by himself. He doesn't know what he's doing. What are you doing, Waddles? Huh? <laughs> doing a little sunbathing. Oh, you're, you're goofier than a cracked egg. All right, enough Waddles time. What do we got? I need to get this done so I can start on my benches. Ah, I got a lot of cleaning to do. Why isn't the lights working? Wait a minute. There, well, it was unplugged because I had my air compressor going. So I, I think I'm just going to set that on this. I'm not going to have to do anything back here for quite a while. So I'm going to put that there. And then uh, I got another recliner coming this week. I'm gonna bring that old recliner out here, one of them. And I'll have a place to relax if I'm doing stuff. So let's get this going. <sighs> Sooner the better. It's getting hot. Guys, I've been using this for a couple months. It's dirty because I just got done cooking breakfast. So there's stuff on there, but they wipe off real easy. I love this thing. I mean, they are great. I figured out 428 is perfect egg cooking temperature. Five something is good for the bacon. Yeah, man. But you just, you go to clean, you pick this thing up, you wipe the whole counter. It's great. And you can put it away if you want. You know, if I need that space for anything, I can just pick it up and put it away and it's great so as soon as it cools down we're going to start getting on some of this that's no priority i got other things going i know drives you guys nuts i don't i don't have this finished but we're going to get to it you know and a lot more so well it certainly looked like the wall had more room till i brought this in pretty much hogs up the whole wall but it's out of the way now i can bring in the uh the exercise equipment that's gonna be fun but we got to get on it because it's 89 degrees and it ain't getting any cooler so when you got something like that you just gotta get into it do it 
and get it over with and fight it and get it in. Maybe it'll be easy. Maybe it's going to be hard. Let's go. I don't know. Here we go. Get the dog bowls out of the way. Woo. You don't just sit there and stare at it. You just get on it. You just get on it. This is the bottom, so I'm gonna. Ah, boy, they, they, there's no kind of exercise equipment that isn't awkward. They're all like this. I think the most, yeah, I can't obviously bring it in that way. It's higher than the door, so just gonna have to carefully put it on this end. Let's get it off the truck. without breaking anything. See, when you live alone all these years, you just learn how to do it yourself. You know, you don't want to bother people to come help. Not when you can do things yourself. You'll figure a way. Ease on down. Uh-uh. There we go. Got about most of it done. No, nope, we don't. We don't have most of it done. <sighs> I won't need to work out today because oh, I guess. I don't know why it couldn't stay out here, actually. Wouldn't get wet in here, would it? It's not a bad idea. Okay, what I want to do is measure how high this is. I'm gonna say six and a half. I ain't got nothing to measure with. This should clear the fan. So I think I'm just gonna try to scoot it. And hopefully, I'm probably gonna have to take one of these off. How does that work? <laughs> yeah, okay, we need to hold it like that. to get smart. We're gonna do the same thing with you, man. Okay, come on in. Hope I didn't break nothing. Now, what we've done is we've made it narrower. Is what we've done. And this thing, will that come off? It sure will. How's it in there? Whoa! I ain't never. All right, let's take this off. We can put that back on, no problem. care how old you are you still got to play now this should go in no problem I want that end in first <clears throat> this dude's heavy I ain't kidding you right. I'm gonna have to move you guys I may have to take this door off. Hopefully not.
Uh, that won't clear. It has to go in. I don't think it's going to make it. It's going to have to go on the end. All right, well, I need to move it back this way then. So I can tip it. Tip it good. Dun, 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 dun. We're in. Not yet. This dang door. Oh, I knew it. I Well, it's just me. All right, it has to go over. Oh. Well, who and why? Why and who? It could still go over. Well, now what's it hitting on? Pull it forward. Oh, there's things catching. Listen, man. You will clear. All right, I need to pull straight. Nabaga. <laughs> Now, ah, oh, hell yes. I think we're home free. What are we hung on? That door. Willie, it's me. Hush. What the hell? Get out of here, door. Oh. Fuck all right, I'm out loud. Oh, let's do it, Jamie. <laughs> oh. All right, guys. All right, not out of breath. All right. Went ahead and turned the fan off. This is this is gonna be close, but I know I know it'll fit. I know it will. So we got to get it over this way. Uh, it should still fit with the fan. I hope so. That'd be nice having that fan just right there. All right. So now I need to tip it forward. And the problem is the ceiling slopes down. So let's just do it. Why? What? Ain't no sitting there. there ain't no use of sitting there and planning stuff. You just do it. That's that's just how it rolls. And this carpet is going to be a hassle. You know, it's stuff like this. When you can no longer do things like this, you need to call the nursing home, get yourself a room, because you shouldn't be living on your own. Or go to the nursing home, find you a woman. That's the only options, man. Well, I do that ceiling fan one day would cause me issues. All right, let's lay it flat. Boy, it's going to be close. And I hope it goes. Ah, let's do it. <laughs> it's going to be close. That's what I'm talking about. Now, I don't think I want this out. I want it this way so I can change my weights. Let's do it. And any way I do it, it's hogging up room. But that's the price you pay. And I need to come out a little. And 
put these back. Oh, what did I do? Why ain't you going back? Well, you did, why not you? What did I do, Benji? How come? Is this what he warned me about? I don't, I don't know. Just don't want to do nothing. I think I broke it. Couldn't have broke it. What is this? Why is that? That has to come out. That's... Ah, it got wedged up in you. Okay. I'll come back when I got all this set up. Now I gotta load 50 weights and bring them in. <laughs> I love it. Alright, I was able to get it all set up. I still gotta bring in the weights. They're in the truck. It's uh, it's over 100 now. Well, close to. It's probably over 100 in here. So that'll go on in the morning when it's cool. That's when I come in here to work out is 6, 7 in the morning. It's usually in the early, you know, low 70s, 60s. So it's perfect. Uh, I had my TV up here. I need to get another one for in here because it's nice to have when I'm working out on the treadmill. Because that's boring. And I took the blower and blew this carpet out a little. Ended Half of it ended up in my face. And I got this all set now. So once we load it, I have the option. Uh, this can come off and hook down there so you can do like curls. You have your arms braced here and then you curl up. So that's going to be great. You can also uh, lift with your do leg lifts here. And it has this butterfly thing here. That's going to be good for the man boobs. So, look here. It's got a picture of that dude who's not even fat. And then it shows you everything right there. And then it's got your resistance charts. But it has a lot of weights to it. It'll probably come up to here more than I'll ever probably use. But I needed something like this because... You know, I can't get a free weight set with my back, and, and this, I think, I, at least I can easily change the weight amounts, and, and it shouldn't be hard to do, and yeah, it just clears the fan. I think I want to get another one of them fans like I have in the house, and then have in the shed. That'll put out a whole lot more air than that. I don't even think that's going full blast, but it would give me more room as well. But for now, that's what we got up here, and... You know, I'm going to call this the room of many options because it has been just about everything except a screened-in patio. It was the puppy, uh, puppy nursery for a while. That was one of its first duties. When Millie had puppies, I had them in here. I got videos on that. Uh, but this is where they stayed until they were old enough. And then I put them out in the kennel. And then we got them home. Uh... Eventually, I want to put regular windows in this, and probably not as big, you know, the bigger, the more expensive, so, but at least, you know, pretty close to what I got here, and, and as I said before, put a more permanent door than that, that's, Tilly's ruined that screen from jumping on here every day at supper time, but I've got a whole big roll of that stuff, and this, this screen's really easy to do. I can go ahead and, you know, if I can find the right windows, I can go ahead and leave the screen part. I may make the windows removable to where it, everything will just pull out. Maybe if I'll build them out of plexiglass or something, that might work for the winter. And then where I can just remove them uh, in the summertime because you need the air flowing through here. This has made a big difference in the winter and summer, putting this uh, foam board up here. It's just a little ugly. But, you know, it's, it's not 100% done like everything I got going. And we'll figure it out. But I just about got all the water issues going, you know, finished. And, and I got to finish. I wasn't going to do anything in here until I got that finished to where it wasn't filling up with water. This side doesn't get any water at all anymore. Uh, and this gets just a little now. I think if I put an additional drain out here, Because the original French drain that I put last year goes right here. But I actually need one here too. So I may dig 
right in here all the way up and I'm gonna put some flashing and do more here but I'm gonna route it into the other one and I should cure that hundred percent and I have added higher soil I added soil here that helped uh, it's trial and error man we'll get it this, this wasn't done right in the first place and uh, that wasn't my doings all right I guess that's it for today man and I broke my other truck key I'm sure Ford is used to that these breaking right there so I have no way to put it on my keychain so I'm gonna have to get some duct tape and wire because I'm gonna look I've already looked for this key four times because I've lost it because it's not on my keychain so I about two hours ago I stuck it in my wallet and I looked all over for it I forgot to put it in my wallet well who puts a key in their wallet really there used to be little spots for in the wallet for that so all right got another tool in the old gym treadmill i don't think i'll have a whole lot of use for that anymore but we'll see i may still you know i got all these dumbbells here and these really weren't heavy enough they're 15 pounds and then i don't know what those are they're just not heavy enough you know it's like lifting a cup of tea so i'll be able to lift as much as i want with this and i'm not going to get you know it's just to get toned up that's all and these will be full of weights next time you see it and let's go let's go see you know we always got to go see them there's brother get a light on well these people want to see you again lily she's just now coming in because daddy was doing laundry and she's afraid of the laundry She's afraid of the washer, and then she's afraid of the dryer. Waldo stole your, he stole your bed, huh? You don't like that bed. He steals it every night, and then you, you're ended up here on the cushion. I know, that boy. He's trouble. Yeah, I'm petting her, not you. All right, tell the people goodbye. I just did laundry. All oh, the shirts were wrinkled coming out of the dryer. I don't know what that is. Too hot, too cold. I never learned how to do laundry. I don't know how to do it. I just throw everything in one 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 load. Whites. Yeah, I don't. And then it comes out wrinkled. I don't care. I'm never going to learn how to do laundry. I don't want to. I just don't want to. That just is not going to be something on my resume is laundry. If people find out you know how to do laundry, next thing you know, you're doing their laundry. And I ain't doing nobody's dirty skivvies. I ain't doing it. I love it. Let's go see where And this one, it's a sick day for her. Every other day, she's sick. And then by a miracle, she's good again. I can tell she's sick because I put some bacon and eggs down for her. And it's still there. Are you are you you sick today? I don't think you are. Here, you got to make a little tent in the chair for her. 